Hey everyone, it's Dave here and today we'll be checking out the part 2 update to Jurassic World Aftermath. It's kinda like what was postponed last year and split the projects in parts before this year's connect. Developers just make sure to actually finish what they started. I'm kinda suspicious now what we'll actually get in the conference itself, like there's so many big games releasing before it like Resident Evil or even Low Neko 2. But to be fair, I think I should be happy because I don't want to have 10 releases in one day to do. I'm already busy enough. So the part 2 patch seems to be essential the wrap up of the whole Jurassic. I do remember that we have yet to discover about two locations that were blocked in the breaker room and after that maybe we'll have some kind of encounter with a T-Rex that we've met in the first minutes of the game. I'm very interested if Code Sync introduced some new mechanics or gameplay fixes. From what I can remember the part one was really redundant because we've had maybe only three four puzzles overall to progress through doors or hacking into the computers being chased down by kinda brainless raptors. Like after a while you would learn their puffing patterns and just wait around in the hideout, sometimes even a couple minutes because they would just run around for no reason, like essentially it became annoying rather something scary. So from this patch I pretty much wish for more gameplay variety, I believe the developers had enough time and feedback to think about it and properly finish the story. Well, let's go back to the park! Jurassic World Aftermath Part 2 will begin immediately upon completing Jurassic World Aftermath. Alternatively, you can play Part 2 straight away by selecting New Game, then start Part 2. I mean, we finished up through, so that's where we kind of got attacked by the raptors. Am I okay to... Hey, is that a... What is that, a tape recorder? <laughs> wow, my goodness, that's... That's vintage. Wait, uh, uh, you know, there were subtitles before. I suppose in-game I'll see. Now called a, a smartphone? Smartphone? <laughs> I don't carry one. I like meeting face to face. Yeah, and while I, I certainly appreciate that, um, what if you need to make a call? You know, you're trapped, it's life and death. What are you gonna do then? I'll survive. <laughs> well, look how things changed. Hey, so what do you do? Oh, me at Everett. I'm a j uh, journalist. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, from the badge, uh, I thought you might be starting at the park. There are some geneticists who want to make the world safer. Surely you'd want them on the inside, in control? Yeah, and that's exactly the problem, arrogance. That control is anything other than a variable in a system that inherently defies it. Hey, maybe you could interview one of these geneticists next, ask them how safe they'd feel trapped and alone with talons scratching at the door. <sighs> Sorry, bad. Happen. Are you okay? Yeah, just say one scientist was determined to make a difference, to change the world. What would they have to do? Subtitles. Where is it? Why it reset it? <laughs> the de-extinction of the dinosaurs wasn't the result of one person, not Ms. Ronnie. Not even Hammond, it's the result of a society. Oh my god, a vignette system. is even on. Stop it game, return my settings. It's technological progress above its own survival. <laughs> A journalist, she says. Um, Miss Everett, who are you reading? God damn it. We don't have nothing to hide. Sam? Mia? You're still with me, right? I think I found something. It's not much, but... I Can you hurry, please? <laughs> didn't. What's that under the desk? An EMF reader. That might come in useful. It tracks electronic frequencies, nodes, devices, or anything fitted with an RFID tag. Call to toggle the EMF reader. What the hell am I? <laughs> 
Oh shit, my ass up. <laughs> Excellent. Now see the console, bottom corner. Oh, okay. We've got work to do. Wu needs us to recover Blue's DNA from storage. Unfortunately, storage is a cryogenic chamber beneath the vault. Just to get inside, we need to add your biometrics to the security database. So when you're ready, go to the breaker room and hit corporate. Yeah, breaker room. Back at it again. Just like I remember, we had two locations to discover yet. For some reason, I feel like there's something here. Okay, head to residence and take the courtyard elevator. <laughs> well, that would be in the residences. Okay. <sighs> Welcome back. Jesus, the vignetting is still here. I wonder if we have still raptors here. Oh my god. It's still Raptor Simulator. <laughs> Stop it. Running around the ceiling. Really? Can't say I miss that. <laughs> well, this looks suspicious. Ah! Fuck up! Not fair. <laughs> so I have to basically slide. Okay. What? Really? And now you don't even appear? I guess I just go. Screw that. Oh my god, they're gonna be annoying. <laughs> we take the elevator. Why he jumped on me there? the new stuff we're getting now. <sighs> Too late. It's blocked. That door. Those vines, can you tear them? With what? My hands? Keep pulling. Hi. Cutie. Private suites, the lounge, and the offices. Try to push through, but <sighs> tread carefully. I don't want you falling through the floor. Stop flying here. There's no hiding spot, so I think we're safe. <laughs> Oh no. Hi. Do you do something? Stop looking at me, you weirdo. <laughs> I thought we'd find him. I mean, I hoped I brought him here. I brought all of us. 
What do you mean? Yeah, like I have other choice now. On the wall. Can you reconnect that socket? I guess they're not dangerous, so that's one thing that won't kill me here. Yet. Oh my god. <laughs> well, he definitely lived in luxury here. Maintenance. Raptor simulator. Oh my god, <laughs> really? I wanted some variety. Get out! Well, let's go with the distractions, I guess. There's no power. Oh, fuck. Oh my fucking god. You asshole, you back. Okay, they still have the same patterns of movement, just annoying. <laughs> Whatever. That's what was annoying in the first part, you would just wait around a couple minutes to just go into the different sections. Like this is knee simulator, literally. Okay, I wanna... I have to stretch. Okay, now we'll be connecting cables. Really, my dude? Oh my god. Basically, we're gonna connect cables by their colors. I guess this will open the door and stuff like that. He's off, he's off, okay. You won't go here, there's no way. Everything's closed. Okay, getting there. Just come through here. Don't eat the lasagna. I really hope there's something else beside that after the section because I don't know if I'm keen to just do the same shit over, but... I'm pretty sure we just have to finish this section and then we'll be able to experience new things. Uh...
Okay, stop it. Yes, they're at the wall. Where the fuck he went? We're Gucci now. Listen to some tunes, man. Okay, the office should be somewhere ahead. You're planning something. Very reassuring. What the hell? Okay, that's a new puzzle actually. <laughs> Not overly complicated, but okay. Some variety, I guess, I asked. Finally, the authentication console straight ahead. Boot up, scan yourself into the system, and we're done. Get yourself together. We're gonna die a thousand miles from home. Because of a flash drive. And because of me. Mia. Oh, no. What the hell? A jack! Hey! Give me this! You gotta get after her! Oh, little pack rat. They'll build a nest out of anything. Oh, what the hell? That's a new puzzle. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, no. Can you get around? Wait, your EMF reader. The key will have an electronic tag. Find the signal and follow it. Oh my god, it's there. Yeah, but the sun does not drive him crazy, okay. 
What the hell? Hey! Shh! Actually, she helped me. Get out. Now we're gonna play what? Catch? <laughs> That is so stupid. Outsmarted. Just... Big. You... Give me this. Okay, let me just sit here <laughs> in the corner and cry. I'll go run around the raptors other time, but there seems to be some new stuff, but I feel like it's gonna pick up the pace later on when we will complete the runes from the breaker room. This feels like exactly the same thing that we've played before, except for maybe a couple small changes, but not very much noticeable that would be like game changing. It's essentially the same experience, but with further levels designed. I mean, to be honest, I'm excited to play it again because I liked the game previously, so it's not like I need some further variety but it's not enough hopefully later on it will be better